everyone, my name is Tana. Welcome to today's playful vinyasa yoga flow. This will be a invigorating intermediate practice where we challenge ourselves and for this practice I really invite you to come with an open mind and invite in a feeling of play into your body, into your space, so that you can explore and just have fun. So if that sounds good to you, Come onto your mat and we're going to start straight away in tabletop position. So you can come onto your hands and your knees, shred through the fingers, curl the back toes under and let's just start with a few cat-cow movements to warm up the spine. So breathing in, arch the spine, drop the belly and exhale round your spine, tuck the chin. Breathing in, lifting through the heart, expanding. Exhale, rounding through the upper back. Last time, nice and slow, breathe into the chest space. Exhale, round your spine. Curl the back toes under, walk the hands forwards in front of you and come straight up into a downward facing dog. Reach your bum all the way up and back. Again, let's begin to pedal out through the feet. Go ahead and walk out your dog. And find any adjustments, any movements that feel good. You might wiggle through the hips. Find your breath. And then find stillness. Push firmly into all four corners of your hands and all four corners of your feet. Inhale, lift the heels off the floor. And then exhale, come forwards into a high plank pose. Push away from the earth. Breathe and melt your hips towards your wrists. Find hanging cobra. Melt the chest forwards and up. Engage the quadricep muscles. On the exhale, bend the knees. Take it back downward facing dog. Gliding your bum all the way back. Really reach back through the tailbone. And we'll go again. Inhale, rock forwards, plank. Exhale, hanging cobra. Melt the heart forwards and up. Pull the shoulders back. Breathe in. Breathing out, down dog, take it back. Last time, breathe in, lift the heels, high plank. Exhale, hanging cobra, lift up through the roof of your mouth. Feel the opening across your heart space. Exhale, downward facing dog. On the next breath in, lift the heels, come into a plank. And then find a side plank on your right wrist, stretching up through the left arm. So you're welcome to drop this right knee to the floor if you need, otherwise keep the ankle stacked and then maybe play with lifting the left foot off of your right. Really grip down into the right hand so you're nice and strong and stable through the right shoulder. One more breath. Left hand meets the earth, other side, stretching up through your right arm. Just find whatever variation you had on the other side. Very nice. Both feet meet the earth. Find a plank. Rock forwards. Chaturanga coming halfway down. Breathe in. Upward facing dog. Lift up through your heart. And then exhale. Downward facing dog. Take it all the way back. Take a full breath in through the nose. And exhale, sigh it out. On the next breath in, send the right leg to the sky. Find a three-legged dog. Flare your hip open, heel towards your bum. Feel the opening, the stretch through the inner thigh. Lift the left heel off the floor. Knee towards your right elbow. Round through the back of your heart, hold. Knee to the opposite elbow. Finding a fallen star, straightening out through your right leg, reaching up through the left arm and breathing fully into the left side. Left hand meets the earth, pull the right knee back in towards the chest. Inhale, three-legged dog, stretch back. On the exhale, find a high crescent lunge, reach all the way up. Lengthen through the spine, breathe in. And breathing out, find a vertical twist, stretching the right arm back, left arm forwards. Inhale, center, rise. 
Exhale, hands to the earth, low lunge. Step it back, plank pose. Take an optional vinyasa here. We'll all meet in a downward facing dog. Reach back through the hips. Plug into the palms. Breathe in. Breathing out. Inhale, left leg rises. Bending through the left leg. Stacking the hips, breathe into the left side. Lift the right heel off the floor on the ball of the right foot. Knee to the left elbow, round through the heart. Knee to the opposite elbow. Straighten out through that left leg. Drop it to the floor, finding fallen star. Reach up through the right fingers. Push the hips up. And then sink the right hand to the floor. Pull the left knee in towards the body. Breathe in, three-legged dog, stretch back. Exhale, high crescent lunge, come forwards. Arms soar upwards. Elongate through the spine. Breathe in. And then breathing out, vertical twist. Spread open through the heart space. Inhale, rise, center. Exhale, hands to the floor, plug in into both hands, plank pose. Chaturanga, halfway. Breathe in, upward facing dog. Push into the tops of your feet. Exhale, tuck the chin, downward facing dog. Two full breaths. Push firmly into the knuckles of the hands. And then we'll repeat that and build from there. Breathing and sending your right leg high. Keep this right leg straight this time. Lift your left heel off the earth. Knee towards your right elbow. Round in through the spine. Knee to the opposite elbow. Fall in star. Straighten out through the leg. Reach up. Open up and lift across the heart space. Beautiful. Left hand meets the earth. Pull the right knee into your chest. Inhale. Three-legged dog. Stretch back. Exhale, high lunge. Softly step forward, arms reach up. Tuck your tailbone, breathe in. Breathing out, vertical twist. Find your breath as we move. Inhale, arms reach back up. This time, as we breathe out, warrior two. Side of your space. Push evenly into your feet. Breathing and reversing the warrior. Breathing into the right side of your body. Breathing out, rainbow warrior, bending into the left leg, straightening out through your right. And breathing in, reversing again, stretching up and over. As you exhale, trikonasana, triangle pose. Straighten out through your legs, sweeping up through the left arm. Try to stack the shoulders broad across the heart. Inhale, reversing the triangles, stretching up through the right fingers. Breathing out, wide-legged forward fold, prasarita. Make sure that the feet are parallel and bow straight in between your legs. Breathe in, halfway lift, lift to the chest. Breathing out, low lunge, back of your space, face your left foot. Ready, plug into your hands and find a three-legged dog. Kick your left leg all the way up into the air. Flay up right open, heel to your bum. Stay here or find a wild thing, flipping your dog over. If you are here, push into both of your feet, squeeze your bum and lift up through the center of your heart, opening and expanding across the front body. Beautiful, drop your hips down, left hand meets the mat, coming back into our plank, pull the left knee into your chest. Inhale, three-legged duck. Exhale, knee to your nose, round it through the spine. Listening carefully, hold. Sink your left knee down to the floor. Spin the left foot to the side of your space. Supported side plank, right arm reaches up and over. Really extend out through the right fingers and breathe into the chest, into the right side. Okay, we're gonna pick the right foot off the floor. Bend through your right leg, reach for your right ankle with the right hand. Finding a bind, push your chest forwards and up, squeeze the bum, breathe. Breathe. 
Beautiful. Let go of your ankle. Drop the back foot down to the floor. Right hand meets the mat. We'll pull the left knee into our chest, finding a one-legged plank here. Breathe in. Three-legged dog. Stretch back. Exhale. Low lunge. Step straight forwards. One breath in. Collarbones broad. Exhale. Wide-legged forward folds. Take a bow in between your legs. Breathe in, halfway lift. Exhale, low lunge, front of your space, facing your right foot. Okay, lovely. Now, listening carefully, sink your left knee to the mat and then start to glide your right leg all the way behind you. You might need to help that foot a little bit all the way back. And then bend through that right leg. Dropping your head back, or we'll find tiger pose now. So left hand reaches back towards your right foot, opposite arm to leg. Reach for the ankle. If you can find a bind here, start to kick into your hand, lift up through the center of your heart, and really make sure that you're grounded and rooted through the right fingers. So you're finding that stability, holding for a few breaths. Pull the belly button in. Beautiful. Without slingshotting, if you can, let go of your foot. Drop the knee down to the floor. Find a kneeling position. Glide your hands over your thighs. Okay, nice work. Lengthen through the spine. Take a breath. Okay, you're welcome to stay here if you want to take it a bit further and play. Finding... Ustrasana now camel pose. So on our knees, you can place your hands to your lower back. Firm your bum, firm your legs, and connect to the center. So nice and stable through the core. Fingers are pointing down here. Start to lift your chest and your pelvis forwards and up. So pushing forwards, but maintaining that connection, that stability through the back body so that we can open up through the front body. If it is in your practice, and you've done this many times before, you can very slowly drop your hands towards your heels and then keep lifting up through the center of your heart as the shoulders draw down and back. Really breathe into your chest. Take three breaths. Then whenever you're ready, when you feel like you need to come out of it, we're gonna meet in a child's pose. And when you do come out of it, Take it really nice and slow. And very slowly, if you're not there already, drop your bum towards your heels. Child's pose, melt your heart over your thighs and draw your hands back, palms facing up and just rest the forehead to the mat. Take four breaths. And nice and slowly, reach the arms out in front of you. Curl the toes under and come up into a downward facing dog. Reaching back through the hips. On your next breath in, send the left leg high, three-legged dog. Lift the right heel off the floor. Knee to your left elbow, round through the upper back. Hold. Knee to the opposite elbow. Straighten out through that left leg. Find a fallen star stretching up through the right arm. Breathe into your chest space. Right hand meets the mat. Pull the left knee into your chest. Inhale, three like a dog. Stretch it all the way back. Exhale, high crescent lunge. Elongate through your spine. Breathe in. Breathing out, vertical twist. Right arm stretches forwards, left arm back. Inhale, center. Exhale, warrior two. Push into the edge of your right foot. And then breathe in, reversing your warrior. Breathing into the left lower ribs. Breathing out, rainbow warrior, taking it back into your right leg. Inhale, reverse your warrior, expanding through the left side. As you breathe out, trikonasana. Bumping your sit bones to the back. 
Staying nice and rooted through both of your feet. Inhale. Exhale, reversing your triangle. Find that expansion through your side. Coming straight into a wide-legged forward fold. Straddle pose, Prasarita. Bow in between your legs. Reach up through your hips. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, low lunge back of your space. We'll come straight into a three-legged dog. Kick your right leg into the air. Bend through your right leg. Take a wild thing if you took it on the other side. Push into your feet, squeeze the bum and really lift up through the heart. Lift up through the pelvis. Breathe into the whole front body. Start to lower your hips down. Right hand meets the mat. Pull the right knee into your chest. And then breathe in, three-legged duck. Stretch it all the way back. On the exhale, knee to your nose, round in through your spine. Hold. Sink your right knee down towards the earth. Spin the right foot to the side of your space. Supported side plank. Left arm stretches up and over. Breathe into the left side. Picking your left foot off the floor. Bend through that left leg. Left hand to your left ankle. Find a bind. Okay. And then pull the frontal ribs in towards the body as you push your sternum forwards. Make sure that you're really gripping down into the right fingers. Let go of your bind. Lower the left foot down to the floor. Left hand meets the earth. Pull the right knee into your chest, finding a one-legged plank. Breathe in, three-legged dog. Breathing out, low lunge, step straight forwards. One breath in, push the heart and the hips forwards. Inhale. Exhale, wide-legged forward fold. One breath in, halfway lift. Breathing out, low lunge front of your space, facing your left foot. Lovely. Sink your right knee down to the floor now. Plugging into both palms, start to glide your left leg all the way back. Okay, we'll take a nice bend into through that left leg. And then arch the spine, point to your toes. Reach back through with the right hand. So right hand to your left ankle and find a bind or work towards finding a bind here. Tiger pose. Making sure that you're nice and rooted through the left hand. Pull the navel in and then see if you can find a bit of height here. So kicking into that hand. Two more breaths. Beautiful guys, slowly let go of your foot. Knee drops down to the floor. Find Virasana, kneeling position. Okay, we're going to go for one more round of camel here. If you're not feeling quite up to it, just stay as you are. Take a few moments of stillness just to ground. Otherwise, come up onto your knees. Hands to the lower back. Or you can place the hands straight to your heels if it's available to you. Again, focusing on that core connection. Keeping the bum active and turned on so that you protect your lower back and you're really bringing this opening into the whole chest space, into your thoracic, and not just dumping into your lower back. Okay, we'll take three breaths to just explore. And as always, just not rushing in and out of the pose, but easing into it. Finding some softness through the breath. When you're ready to come down, lead with your hips, bum towards your heels and melt your body over your thighs. Child's pose, drop your forehead down to the earth, hands facing the sky. Breathe into the back body, relax the shoulders and the neck. On your next breath in, start to roll up through the spine. And then we'll slide the legs over towards the right side and meet in a cross-legged seat, placing your right foot in front of your left foot. And let's grow tall through the spine as we reach up. Inhale. Exhale, twisting to the right side, left hand to the right thigh. Broadening into the heart, broadening into the chest. And 
and slowly unraveling, facing the front, changing the cross of your feet. And breathe in, arms reach up, lengthen. And then exhale, taking it to the other side. Close down the eyes, allow the energy and your breath to start to settle, to slow down, to find a steady rhythm. And as you breathe out, make your way back to the middle and draw your hands together at the heart to close, to seal everything in. Let's take a nice big breath in through the nose. Exhale to sigh it out. Namaste. Thank you so much for practicing with me. I hope you enjoyed this strong, fiery practice. If you did, please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me grow and it keeps me motivated to continue to put out these free um, flows for you guys. And I love hearing from you. I read all of your comments and I answer all of your comments. Um, in the comment section below. So do let me know how you go. And if you have any requests, let me know as well. All right, have a beautiful day and I will see you soon.